Hello, YouTubers! I am WiredBand39, and are you ready to get wowed by one of the best islands on Pop Tropica? Of course you are, unless you wouldn't have clicked on this video! Anyway, this is Shrink Ray Island. Um, I chose to do this one because it's short and fun. Um, I'm gonna do so much commentary, you are gonna be laughing your head off by the time I finish this island. Um, don't worry, that's not an actual meaning. Like, I'm not actually gonna make you laugh your head off. Forget it, forget it, forget it. Anyway, so, you're gonna enter the school building on the right, and you're gonna enter the science fair. Woo! -hoo. Now, you have to enter this for two seconds, but you have to do it because, um, you need to talk to this girl CJ's parents. Now, CJ is a very important part, so listen to everything I just said. This is Mr. Silva. He's the science teacher holding the science fair. These are CJ's parents. Talk to CJ's dad. Now, CJ isn't here for the science fair, and CJ is a science fanatic. So, CJ's dad says to go check on CJ in Avenue A. Now, that's very nice. I mean, he's relying a lot of trust in me. But what I don't ever understand is, why is he letting me, a complete stranger who just recently came to this island not even a minute ago, and lets you into your house? That's what I don't understand. And besides, he doesn't technically give me a key, but if you go before you talk to him, he doesn't, it doesn't let you in. So technically, he's giving me the keys to the house. I mean, I wouldn't go up to a stranger and go, here, check on my cat. Here, take this now. I wouldn't do that. By the way, I don't have a cat, but still, I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't go up to some random stranger and say, here, check on my little daughter. You know there are worse things to, stay, to say than that, but, you know, I'm trying to keep it clean. So you're going to go right to Avenue A. There aren't actually many go rights, go lefts in this. Well, the main base. And you'll see what I mean very soon. Now, you're probably wondering, like, why is this called Shrink Ray Island? This is not even close to a Shrink Ray. I want to see some awesome Shrink Ray. And actually, I'm holding the Shrink Ray from Shrink Ray Island. That's why I also chose to do it. You'll see this telescope here. That's very important. And you see, you're going to see a cat. So, obviously, because you have some magical key, you can enter. And... You say you let the cat in the house, and you'll see this This house is really beat up. I would survey the surroundings. Even I'm going to do it now. Look at everything in this house, because guess what? You're going to be needing it a lot more than you need it right now. So, all you have to do is find the cat here and chase it into the bathroom. Just enter the bathroom. It's kind of a slow beginning, but once it will pick up very fast, trust me. Okay, so this is the bathroom. Survey the bathroom a lot, just know that. Okay, so you s survey the bathroom. They actually put the cat in here so that you are forced to look at your surroundings, and that's what I'm telling you to do. The cat's gone. Alright, so... You say, I wonder why it got out of the door. Never mind, I said I should search for clues. And you pretty much realize that CJ's not here. And you see this mini pop tropical blimp. It's awesome. And that's actually a pretty cool part of this island. Um, so you're going to go around and you'll see this microscope. Click on it. It says, my invention's been stolen. Trust no one. Everything. Everything you need to know is in the house. Think small. Hmm. Think small. Uh-oh. Mask Warrior! And, as you see, we both have the same exact gun. But anyway, this guy is going to chase me down to the wall, and I am going to get completely screwed. Guess what? Shrink Ray! Yes, I have just been shrinking down to small size. So, 
you'll see that you're very small, and that toy blimp is actually your way out because you can't just immediately... Wait, I'm sorry. Sorry, guys, that was my phone. Um, so you'll notice that this blimp is here, and it actually has you travel from island to island while you're small, um, while the other blimp is, you know, bigger. Um, a couple things to note, you're going to see this huge billboard, and something you're really going to need to know is X87Y16. Now, if you've done um, Astro Knights Island, you've noted, you, you'll probably know coordinates are very prominent, and coordinates are pretty prominent here, too. So, you're going to just bro browse around, you're like, come on, what do I do now? I mean, I have to get back, right? And that's true, you do have to get back some way, but I know exactly how you're going to do it. Jump up here, and you're going to just wait until the fan slides down. Yeah. And many people forget to do one thing that's very important, and their whole game gets screwed up. Press the button, people. So you're going to be able to, oh god, you're going to be able to press this button and all the wind will blow and you'll see this little thing under the bed and it's a thumb drive. Be careful of the spinning blades. People hit it and they're like, what the heck? I didn't, I didn't do anything. Exactly, you touch uh, spinning blades of a fan. If you put your finger in that, it will get chopped off, god dang it. So... You'll see the thumb drive and a couple other things. It will fall. All this. Okay, so you don't have to deal with most of this right now. You, all the pieces, as I said, will come together. All of these different miscellaneous objects that you see will come together eventually. Not right now. Um, so you're going to see all of this stuff. And you're just going to keep going right. Yeah, and that's all you can do right now. <laughs> Careful of the cat, please. Yes, the cat will try to get in, so it will swipe you under the door. Aha. Uh -huh. Alright, so, just keep walking right. Everybody finds a problem, like, What do I do now? What do I do? That's why I'm here, people. Please wait until the end of the movie to ask me questions and comment. Yes, thank you. Okay, so you're gonna see that there's a lot of stuff in here. The kitchen is where you want to stay right now, and this is the kitchen, by the way. Um, you probably don't notice it because it's small now. So you're just gonna jump on this sponge thing and you get elevated a little bit to the spray bottle. And once you're in the spray bottle, guess what, guys? You're small, so you can jump in the garbage! That's what I want to have for Christmas! I want to have a ticket to the garbage can! Yeah, but there's a note in here that is really important. So you decide to go dumpster diving, literally. So this you have to be very careful with. Click on any container to move it. Well, not any container, but stuff that looks movable. You're going to push this back, but be very careful, because guess what? The wall's going to fall down. So run away, and then you can jump up here. Push this milk carton. You have no other choice but to push it down. Woohoo! Woo okay, so this is a very confusing part for some people, and I can understand why. Push this right, first of all. Care careful of the falling wall. Okay, so now you're going to push this cheese left and left again. That way it doesn't get in your way. Then you're going to pull this cheese left. That way you have room for other miscellaneous objects. Okay, so you are going to... Oh, wait a minute. I'm sorry. This is wrong. Pull this this way. And then you're going to jump around 
and push it down. That's why. Okay. So you're going to push it down and this is going to be pushed here and remember falling wall people. And the reason you pushed this in was because now you have a wall to go from. So push this that way and you're free of harm. Okay, so now you have a staircase to the note. Sort of. You just have to pull this out. That doesn't fall on you. And you get this note. Woohoo! Okay, so you get this torn page, which they call it. Um. So now you're going to go through this side if you haven't, well, you don't really haven't already, but it would be really stupid to go through here before you have to. So this is a little tricky, I'd say, for some people. Just pull this out a couple times and don't get crunched in. Come here and push it and push it again so that it's out of your way that's why they do these alcoves now take this and pull it out the wall falls and you make another staircase it's not hard not at all I figured it out in less than five minutes even though it's been five minutes I've been in here so anyway so you're gonna jump up and you're gonna make the staircase the way to the to, this is what I really find funny about this whole um, garbage thing. At the end, it says, leave trash. Alright, so I'm going to cut the camera, that way it doesn't screw up. Okay, I've dropped down from the garbage can, and now I'm just going to keep jumping up, and I got this screwdriver now. Awesome. So... Now things start coming into place and you can start doing some stuff. So I'm going to show you a couple things you can do right now. And I know I'm a little pressed for time, so I'm going to try to get some things done. So, you're going to see there's this note, there's another note, believe it or not. So, move the rolling pin. And it will move this, this uh, teapot here jump into the steam and fly up okay all you have to do here is push the oil down once you do that you are able to fall okay so the oil is a little bit of a marker and a, and a bit of a helper too so just push the bowl right under where the oil is dripping and and guess what? You get to have some kitty crunchies. So you're going to jump on this and keep jumping on it until you think there's enough. I usually jump on it three times. So, yeah. So it will make, it will eventually have enough kitty crunchies and it will make this flat top thing. And it's a little hard to push. I don't know why they didn't fix this. But, oh, I'm a little pressed for time right now. So guess what I'm going to say? And you're probably not going to like it. I'm going to stop the camera as soon as I stop pushing this stupid... Okay, I'm good. So, let's quickly try to do this. The grape falls. I get a piece of paper. And I'm going to stop here. Alright, guys. This is Wired Band 39 Signing out. I'll pick up next time.